Hello beautiful people. Welcome to the Fluent Lifestyle. My name is Lo and today I'm continuing my journey towards financial freedom. Welcome to the last day of 2022. I don't know about you, but I am so excited for 2023 and I've already chosen my word for the year, which is restitution. There have been so many things that have happened, not only in 2022, but 2021 as well, that have really, really rocked me harder than I thought it was going to. And I, I intentionally wanted to go into the new year with a new mindset, a healthy, healed and renewed mindset. And when I was thinking on that, what came to mind was being paid back 10 times over for all of these things that I've lost and I've suffered and I've grieved over. And I fully believe that 2023 is going to be my year to collect. That's going to be my year of restitution and it brings a smile to my face. So to honor that, I want to go through all of the money that I've been able to save for myself and my family and also by reviewing the money or excuse me reviewing the balances I'm hoping that um, I don't know it just inspires and motivates somebody else to to join along in this journey with me so <laughs> I don't know why I'm all stuttering and whatnot but I'm excited to get started so let's go ahead and do that so today we are using the Affluent Lifestyle Monthly Envelope Review for December 22. And um, it is the whole year in review, but we're doing it in December. So this document has a place for you to write in the month year. It can be customized if you want to change the, the information you want to put on this line or if you wanted to add more lines. And then of course, to list all your envelopes and sinking funds and all that it comes with uh, an additional area for any special challenges that you might have um, started through the year but are not listed here and any notes and considerations that you want to bring forward into the next month as well as an area for your starting balance your end balance and what the type of uh, change it was and this is going to be made available in my Etsy shop. And again, it's fully customizable. So let's see, the special challenge that I did this year was the, the 2022 envelope challenge. So I'm gonna make sure, it is, it's a little bit difficult to write like this, but I'm gonna make sure that I get that balance in there. And look, um, I'm ready to go, let's do this. I took a moment to go in and fill in the old balances, balances for most of the envelopes. Not all of them, because you know I don't check some of these envelopes until the end of the year, and then some of the envelopes are brand new. So let's jump into my son's binder. So in his savings, he has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight thousand, one hundred. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 400, 410, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, wait, 55, <laughs> wait a minute, what is this, oh my goodness. I had to start that over because they were bills all over the place. So let's go ahead and try again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight thousand. Eight thousand one hundred. One, two, three, four, two hundred. Two, four, six, eight, three hundred. Two, four, six, eight, four hundred. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 500, 5, 10, 15, 20, 21. So that's 8,521. 8,521 minus 8,295. This is an increase.
price of 226 Okay, and in his first car, he's got 1,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 600, 650, 700, 2, 4, 6, 80, 90. Um, 80, 90, 800, 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23. 823 and then 1823 minus 1653 is an increase of 17 or $170 so this doesn't need to be there because he's just started well as a matter of fact no I did start him off once with a little something something in there so he has he has seventy dollars in there. Seventy ends with. Actually, we'll say that it started with zero and it's ending with seventy, so that's an increase of seventy dollars. And we'll put that in the bank account for him. And then we go to his Merrill all the way down here. So in Merrill. Organize first. In his Merrill, he has 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 270, 290, 310, 320, 330, 340, 350, 360, 370, 380, 390, 400, 410, 420. 425, 430, 435, 440, 445, 450, 455 dollars. That is super odd. Huh, that's curious. So it looks like we are headed over to the savings binder. Now this one is fat and it's gonna be crazy. So let's go ahead and get this started with the emergency fund. And now, in emergency, we've got one, two thousand, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, three thousand, one, two, three, four, five, three thousand five hundred fifty-five. Three thousand five hundred fifty-five minus twenty-seven fifty-five is an increase of eight hundred dollars. We love to see it. Love to see it. And I think of what I'm going to be doing for this new year is starting over with zero balances. So the money is going to be deposited into the bank account, but I'm seriously considering zeroing everything out and I'm um, starting fresh fresh from scratch all right so the next one we go to is the vacation fund and in vacation we've got 20 40 50 60 70 75 80 85 90 and I'm not surprised here because we did go to Jamaica and I emptied out everything there. So whatever was in the vacation fund, it was well spent. Had a little bit of technical difficulties. The camera just stopped recording in the middle of this. I have no idea what was captured and what wasn't captured. And I'm a little bit concerned, but um, I don't know. We'll see what happens when I go to when I go to edit the video. All right, so we've got hundreds, twenties. Let's see how much we've got in the 2020, 20, 20, oh lord, <laughs> 2022 envelope challenge. One, two, three, four hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, five hundred. 20, 40, 60, 80, 600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 700, 10, 20, 30, 40, 
41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. $756. That is <laughs> not bad at all. Can't say the same for my handwriting. Okay, and then my favorite, we are headed over to the, uh, what do you call this thing? Why is there $2,000 in here? Hmm. Stuff like this that I can't remember doing really worries me. So I've got $2,000 placeholders in there, and I don't know why, but uh, I know for a fact that I hit every single goal. So, I mean, not every goal, but every deposit. So if there's anything less than what I think is supposed to be in there, I'm really gonna have some explaining to do. This is a mess, what am I doing? 5K challenge. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Here it goes 2,000. 2,000, hello. 2,100, 2,200, 2,300, 2,400, 2,450. Oh, 2,450. I'm just gonna put that right there. Two, four, six, eight, 100. Two, four, six, eight, 200. So that's plus 200. 20, 40, 60, 80. Let's just go ahead and add that 80. Easier on my brain. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. So we're adding 50. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. Plus 40. So this is an increase of 4,820. I've been sitting here freaking out trying to figure out what's going on with the Masters Plus 30 because I do take money from the accounts, which is why I don't go a little bit too nutty when balances are lower than what they're supposed to do. I don't like the surprise though because I, like I keep saying, I usually write myself little notes. But what really took me, just confused me is, is this line right here and come to find out the money that I put away for my son's Merrill account I accidentally wrote that in masters so in his Merrill he starts with zero he has 455 in there which is an increase of four hundred fifty five dollars and then these are not supposed to be here Whew. so <laughs> hopefully Hopefully that just clears up all that, no more crazy mistakes. We are moving over to the home folder and let's see if we can get this done quickly. So we've got in home 50, 70, 90, 100, 110, 115, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. That is 122 for a, de a decrease of $63. Car maintenance has one, 200, 250, 270, 290, 310, 330, 350, 360, 370, 380, 390, 395, 400, 510. 410, let's just use the calculator for this, minus $410, so that is an increase of $65. So happy for this, um, this folder. I'm glad I made that decision, and it's definitely one of the things um, that I'm thankful for this year, because some of these, whew, some of these balances, or some of these bills are out of control. One, two, three, four hundred, four fifty, four seventy, four ninety, five ten, five thirty, five forty, five fifty, five sixty, five seventy, five seventy-five, eighty, eighty-five, ninety, 
95, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96. This is 596. 835 minus 596. That is a decrease of 239. This has 120, 40, 60, 80, 185, 90, 95, 205 dollars. 205, so that is a decrease of 340. Then we go to entertainment and family fun. This has 25 dollars in it. 90 minus 25 is a decrease of 165. Yes, I am zero zeroing out everything. All right, and then we're done with this binder. Then we go to the final binder. Well, close to final binder. I still have the 100 envelope challenge that needs to be counted up. So the debt snowball, which is down here, we start with zero. In the debt snowball, we've got 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 245, 50, 55, 60, 261, 62. That is an increase of 262. All right, in my Merrill, I've got 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 220, 230, 240, 250, 260, 270, 280, 290, 300, 310, 343, 50, 360, 365, 370, 75, 80, 85, 90, 400, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 405, so we start with zero, increase our balance of 405, which is an increase of $405. And then in gas, in gas we've got, where's the gas one? Gas, oh, we started with money and gas. That's weird. But things are just weird every day. <laughs> 1, 2, 250, 300, 350, 400, 450, 500, 5, 20, 40, 60, 80, 620, 30, 635, oh, what's 635, 640, and then this is 650. 650, which of course is, is not even a true balance because just picked up um, gas uh, yesterday. So I'm gonna be tearing through that. All right, so Easy Pass has 100, 20, 40, 50, 150, 160, 65, 70. So this is 170, which is an increase of $35. Ooh, reward. All right, teaching is my jam. I've got 20, 30, 40, 45, $46, and teaching is my jam. 46, so 142 minus, 142 minus 46. That is a decrease of $96, as it should be, as it should be. All right, so I've got in Masters, 1, 2, 300, 350, 400, 450, 470, 490, 510, 520, 530, 535, 540, 545, 550. 20, I think that's seventy dollars, right? Let me just double check. Four eighty minus five fifty. Yep, it is an increase of seventy dollars. And the thing of it is, um, as far as the masters go, I am being pushed to go back into administration, and it's a positive push. It's not like uh, pressure or anything like that, but. Um, I've been asked to prepare for leadership and I have to decide if that's something that I want to do. It'll be more money, of course. 
it also be more responsibility and less daily interaction, deep daily interaction with the students. So that is a decision that I have to make. Right now we're in Lux Life, which has 150, 170, 190, 195, 96, 97, 98, 99. Ooh, almost $200. I'm tempted to go in here and grab a dollar just to make it an even 200. But let's 199 minus 174. We won't do that. Sometimes I look at these balances and I wonder, like I'm not upset, right? I just wonder, how is it in a whole year I only deposited $25? And I know I didn't, it's just I used the money, but it's just surprising to see that. All right, in pet care, I'm gonna organize this better next year. In pet care, pet care we've got one, two, three, 350, 370, 390, 410, 430, 440, 445, 450. So 450, okay, 450 minus 380, that is an increase of $70. Let me make sure that looks like an increase because I'll look at that as a, as a four. It is not easy to write on these things, y'all. 10 and five, okay. And now we go to the vitamins and supplements. So that's 1, 2, 250, 300, 350, 400, 420, 430, 435, 440, 440. 775 minus 440 is a decrease of 335. All right, and then dining out definitely comes in handy because you know I love to eat out. I love it. Okay, so in dining out there is 1, 2, 250, 270, 280, 290, 295, 300, 305, 310, 311. In dining out, 311 minus 256 is an increase of 55. All right, we are now in Etsy, and Etsy has 50, 70, 90, 110, 120, 25, 26, 27, 28. 128, 128 minus 82 is an increase of $46. Nothing in subscriptions. That's a brand new envelope for this coming year. I want to begin a sinking fund for prescriptions, prescriptions, subscriptions, and just have that money there, especially for those annual subscriptions. So I'm not surprised. And I've got like two annual subscriptions that come out. All right, so now let's move this out of the way. We go to the 100 envelope challenge. I gotta be careful with this because the last time I did the 100 envelope challenge, I left money in some of these envelopes and I was unhappy with that. All right, so I will be back after I organize all of this money. When I am stuffing this 100 envelope challenge, which I've been doing for the past couple of years, I look at all the envelopes that don't have any marks on them. Like these have two, oh, three, so I missed the 106. This one doesn't have any of them crossed off, not even the $8. And I just, sometimes I feel a little bit like, oh man, I wish I could have done better with that challenge. But at the end of the day, when I pull out the amounts of money that I did manage to save using that challenge, I mean, this is, I'm not gonna sleep on this. This is a blessing. So let's go ahead and count this up and see how much I actually saved from that 100 envelope challenge. And I think with the 100 envelope challenge, I 
think it's supposed to be $10,000 altogether if you manage to save up all of it, but I'm not 100% sure. I'm gonna keep a running total and let's go ahead and let's get it. Got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hundred. One hundred, fifty, two hundred, fifty, three hundred, fifty, three hundred, fifty, four hundred, fifty, five hundred, fifty, two, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, two hundred, twenty, forty, sixty. It's so hilarious how I forget how to count in the middle of counting. I swear to goodness. <laughs> 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 110, 20, 20, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, plus 70. Okay, and then the singles. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. Plus 40. So we saved, starting at zero, $1,840, which is an increase of $1,840. Not too bad, not too bad at all. So it looks like the last thing that I need to do is this uh, dollar challenge. So let's get all these dollars out and see how we did there. Goodness gracious. Okay. Let's see how many dollars I have. And it's, it's crazy because it seems like there's a lot, but I wouldn't be surprised if it's eh, somewhere between 50 and $100. All right, let's do this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. That's okay. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 56. Ah, I gotta start over. All right, 20, 40. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80. 182, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Look, I called it. I called it. I called it. I knew it wasn't going to go over 100. I think that speaks to the power of our words. I should have said, you know what? There's got to be at least $1,000 in this pile of hundreds, or pile of ones. That's my fault. You gotta use your words wisely, y'all. Gotta use your words wisely. All right, so we've got $100 here. I've got to, I've got to add all of this up and figure out what exactly we did this year. So we've got a balance. Like cash money on hand, $28,509. I'm finished. I'm finished. Like I'm so flipping excited for this month. $28,509. Y'all, if you could feel the excitement that's coursing through my veins right now at that balance. And remember, I started at $0 a few years ago. 
and I started recording I think last year or maybe late 2021 I don't remember when I started recording but I was just slowly putting money away five dollars here twenty dollars there fifty dollars and then I started doing the savings challenges which is really tough because at some points I was pulling two hundred and forty dollars from a paycheck and putting it into savings but y'all the numbers don't lie the numbers don't lie look at that look at that when I tell you that this is one of the best decisions I could have ever made. I am not lying. I'm about to go deposit almost $30,000 into my bank account. Granted, some of that money is already in the bank, so I'm not actually taking $30,000 and depositing it into the bank, maybe maybe $18,000. I don't know how many $100 place or $1,000 placeholders I have here. But the fact of the matter is, it's been another successful year. I don't even know what to say <laughs> except thank you for spending some time with me and watching me as I bank this money y'all you can do it too if I can do it you can do it I swear to goodness I want to wish everybody everybody those who hear my voice those who can't even hear my voice who are not watching this video everybody have a wonderful new year choose a word for the year mine is restitution and it's going to happen you choose a word for the year do your vision board set your intentions and make it happen 2023 is going to be whew, a wonderful year year of seven it's going to be awesome and i'm excited to start this over again and see what else i'm gonna have in the bank i'm so excited happy new year y'all this is a fluent lifestyle giving you a friendly reminder to live life affluently bye